What is up guys, it is Spreading Hybrid here with yet another tutorial. Today I'm going to teach you guys how to recolor an entire sprite sheet within seconds. So what you're going to do first is open up GIMP. If you don't already have GIMP, I'll put a link to it in the description because uh, I really don't know how to work with Photoshop so I really couldn't tell you how to do this method in Photoshop. Um, if you want to get a tutorial for that, Redhead Henry has one of those I believe. So. Can go there, but if you're a GIMP user like me and you want an easy way, preferably I like to say easier than Red's way, then this is a video for you. So, what you're going to do is open up GIMP, hit File, Open, and open the sheet you want. I'm going to do a Sonic, so just click on him and click Open. And so it takes long for some reason. There we go. Now, once you open them, the first thing you want to do, the very first thing you want to do is go over to Image, Mode, and make sure it's set to RGB because that is the mode that allows you to recolor and edit it basically at all. So now we can zoom in a little bit. Just got a little too much. Uh, right about here. All right. Now it doesn't matter which pose you're on because we're recoloring the whole thing anyway. So I'll just use this one here. Now I'm just gonna warn you first. This method it works great. It works fine. But on some sprite sheets where where the uh let's say his shoes uses these two uh color palettes, this red and this this red and this red, a darker and a lighter red, and his body uses those same reds, you wouldn't really be able to to distinguish the difference between those colors without doing it individually yourself. Because uh this method just selects all the colors on the entire sheet. So but for Sonic this will work fine. So uh, since your mode already set to RGB, the first thing you're going to do is use the Select by Color tool. And click that, and then you're going to click any shade of blue you want to start off with. So I'll start with this lightest shade. And you click it. So as you can see, it selects that shade on every single one of his poses. There's more, but I'm not going to bother zooming out for you because you're not that special. <laughs> Just kidding. But uh, So after you do that, you're gonna hold you could just go ahead and reshade it one by one and do each of the shades individually but if you want to do it a little easier what you can do is hold shift and click the next shade and I'll select that one as well as the last one you did and then select the last one the darkest shade just like that same thing hold shift and click and then you get all of them so now the whole blue on his body is selected and ready to be recolored and what you're gonna do is you're gonna select the rectangle tool or any of these tools as long as it's not that tool because then you're gonna select another color and you don't want to do that. So once you do that, you can go over to colors, colorize, and voila, your entire sheet is recolored. You can just move around with the hue and change it to whatever you want. You know, if you want a purplish, you can go like that. You can make it brighter, as bright as you want, like a little emerald looking color. Uh, you can make it dark, really dark. You can make it black if you want. And uh, you know, it's pretty limitless as to what you can do. You can even go to the extreme and uh, add gradients and noises. Those are a bit more difficult to work with, but uh, as you can see, this method is really simple. You know, you can desaturate if you want it to be black and white. That's a nice look. So you're pretty much limitless as to what you can do with this method, and it works in seconds. After that, you would just click OK, and then, as you can see, the entire sheet has been recolored for you. So that's about it. I hope this helped you guys out. All oh, right, and after you're done, hit Control A, so that way you're not selecting anymore, so you can look at it individually. But after that, that's about it. So I hope this helped you guys out. And uh, rate, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys later.